After two days of delays, the swimmers are in the River Seine. The Summer Olympics in Paris kicked off last week, but both the men's and women's triathlons were postponed because of contaminated water. Officials now declaring the Seine is safe again and only low levels of E. coli and other bacteria are being detected. Olympic fans say they couldn't be happier despite the risks to the athletes. It was very exciting and I think it was very brave and I think hurrah that they've done it. It's the Olympics and if you're going to get sick for one race of the year, it's this race. The triathlons on Wednesday capped a years-long effort to clean the badly polluted river flowing through the heart of Paris. It cost more than a billion and a half dollars, but in the end, city officials say it was worth it. La Seine a été pendant... The Seine was for years considered like a sewer, and people's collective imagery reconquering and cleaning this river seemed impossible. Most experts agree the main issue has been rain, which causes bacteria levels in the river to rise. Olympic organizers were hoping for a dry year, but instead it turned out to be the rainiest in three decades. And with climate change bringing more storms, there's no easy fix to what most agree will be a long-term problem. Rain events uh, are more frequent and more severe, so these underground tanks simply don't have enough capacity to hold this much of rain. That's why we see more and more sewer overflows. And Paris is going from one extreme to another. Those heavy rains were followed by a heat wave that sent temperatures close to triple digits. In London, Greg Palcon, Fox News.